I didn't know why I was coming to this party. And then I saw you and I thought, that's why. As I walk along, I wonder what went wrong with our love. Living in Austin really led to the genesis of this movie because there is so much music there. Um, the festivals are happening, bands and singers and performers are coming and going constantly, and it's just a, it's a music culture, and so it really lends itself to a story set in the music business. I think it's really helped Terry to kind of wrap his head around this whole idea. We thought we could just roll and tumble, live from song to song, kiss to kiss. We should make a record together. I know you do the live music thing, but you want to make some money? We've got talent. Having, you know, actors as well known as our cast is a challenge anywhere because they're going to get, you know, surrounded. It helped to be around movie, uh, rock and roll stars because they're getting a lot of attention themselves and sometimes they may be even more interesting to, you know, uh, the crowd. So that was just, you know, its own sort of challenge of people in, in crowded places. But it was interesting because we've been working very with a very small crew for a long time now. And it really suited, our style of shooting really suited working in these festival situations because, you know, we could we could go in there with a tiny van load of people, like, you know, a camera person at a first day C, a second running mags, because we were shooting film, um, you know, a first AD, a sound person. Like, we had the teeniest crew you could imagine, and we could just slip in and slip out and, you know, um, there was it was no big set. We don't work. We don't light. We work with natural light. Our team has gotten extremely skilled at working with natural light and finding the finding the areas. And Terry's really good at showing the actors how to work with that and making sure that they have their light and they know where to be and where where to avoid. And um, so it that part actually went really well. The sort of chaos of music festivals somehow suited our style of very free form, very small. Uh, crew and production. Help me. I have a condition. I can't be left alone. <laughs> I'm part of any Terry likes to work with a lot of different kind of cameras, but for the most part, we shoot film. And for the most part, it's all either handheld or uh, steady cam. You know, uh, Chivo and his operator, Jorg Vidmer, uh, who's also been with us since the New World, um, really have a, you know, a sort of dancer's relationship with each other and with the actors. And so it's it's very intimate, it's very close, it's very trusting. And, um, um, you know, it just, it, they, they, Jorg is such an amazing operator and he understands what both Chivo and Terry are going for in terms of framing, but also camera movement. And, you know, it's not about perfection, it's about intimacy and it's about immediacy and it's, you know, it's about pulling you into the frame and, and he just does that like no one else. Say it like you mean it. Say it like you mean it. 